Hey guys, welcome to the shed for another episode about the Mississippi Mudslide, an ES-175 kit guitar from Guitar Kit World. Uh, you know this is going to be a good episode because I got this Chick Flick Teal shirt on. And when that happens, the episode is going to be good or either that or I'm trying to distract you away from this industrial accident I had with my hairdo today by sporting some Oscar de la Rented flashy outfit to take you out in the weeds. Anyway, whatever. You all are smart enough to figure that out, I hope. Um, I have shown you through a playlist up there. Chick Flick Teal Pointers still laid up on the couch from the holidays. But click that link up there. And it takes you from the moment I opened the box on this thing uh, when we threw Mississippi mud clay all over it, literally uh, threw Mississippi river water on it, put all this scrap apparatus on here, put all kinds of uh, relics on it, and made it the unique instrument it is. Anyway, we're going to take this thing out and get it played, because you know, you can build a guitar all day long, and if the action isn't right, if the neck isn't right, it becomes a wall hanger that somebody, uh, wall hanger is a fancy word for yard sale art is kind of what that's all about. Yeah, I know, I know. Y'all don't like that. Well, guess what? So anyway, we are going to go into an environment that is as close to a barrel house as we can get. And a barrel house was a place where people would just come and party. It might be a house, might be a shed, might be something, but, um, it's just people sitting around playing music. So we're looking for that 1930s thing. And I got just the guy for you. And so we're going to go see R.J. Mishu play this guitar, sight on scene, no practice, whatever happens, whatever is whatever happens. I think that's a good test uh, for this guitar. So the one thing I will tell you is David Lee Roth sounds just like R.J. Mishu. That said, let that sink in, listen for it, wait for it, and let's get to Ventura finally.
Right now she don't need no fancy clothes Uh-uh She don't need diamonds or pearls Little girl, she don't need anything She just gonna rock this world My baby's good to me My baby's so good to me Sugar and it's all so sweet My baby's good
right. Wasn't that great? Of course it was. If it wasn't, it wouldn't be on my channel. Thank you, R.J. Mishu. Uh, again, R.J. Mishu is a harmonica player, or they call it a harp. No, not with the with the halo and, and the wings and the thing you stand up and do this with. Not that. Uh, but nice part about it is he'll just pick up anything and play it. And uh, that's what he did. So I'm happy the way this turned out. Again, as I've told you before, I float around L.A. looking for Florentine cutaways, fake ES-175s, uh, little K's, that, K1s, and old craftsmen stuff, big-bodied arch tops. And I usually got to put a lot of work in them. But for what I paid for this kit, one more time, just the neck and the body, the way it came, the way it fit together, and it was... The way it was ready to go to war for me was incredible. So thank you, Guitar Kit World. You couldn't have done any better there. Um, we've seen all different configurations go on here, different hardware and stuff, and, and you heard it tonight. So um, that's good. Now, there is going to be one more episode, one more, so we can complete that playlist up there. And we are going to go to a place where I think I will put on my suit and and uh, go to a church. It'll be around Christmas time, but that doesn't make me a poinsettia. I'm not a poinsettia or an Easter lily, where I just go to church twice a year. I go at least three times. So anyway, um, mind your own business about that anyway. So um, I'll see you in the next episode. The place we're going has a lot to do with all this scrapparatus we have on here, and I think you're going to be completely and utterly disamazed. Now, you can't be completely and utterly disamazed if you don't like my stuff and subscribe to my channel. I like to chat with you all day long, but I got to get to other content I'm making. So again, so you can be completely and utterly disamazed. I'll see you next time. I will look spiffy, son.